that in that run, it goes G. Then C. D. And then B part. So right there is a C part. Sandridge, so I thought uh, my Sandridge fiddle thing. Yeah. I thought of the hammered Ulster thing too. Double dip. <laughs> On? Oh, we're on. We've been on for oh, a few minutes. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> As always. Yeah. <clears throat> Hi, everybody. We're coming. Okay, ready? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey. Hey. Uh, hey. Welcome to the Baltimore Old Time Jam. Everybody around the world, <laughs> in here, out there. Brad Kalodner here with Ken Kalodner. We've got Alex Lacomont. And we're going to hang out for the next couple hours playing some tunes. Before we get started, make sure you uh, spread this uh, event both on uh, Facebook and YouTube. Share it with your friends. Let's get as many people in here as we can. This is the one year anniversary of our virtual Baltimore Old Time Jam. Yippee. Both a celebratory <laughs> yet... Uh, I don't know what the scary other scary thought. Scary thought that we've been doing this now for a year. Can't wait to play with you in person, but uh, we've we've had a fun time this past year doing these jams, and we've basically been doing them every other week. A couple little breaks here and there, but yeah. uh, thanks to all of you for donating and tipping and supporting this jam by showing up, showing up every week, mm -hmm. and suggesting tunes, sharing all of the this, above. all yeah. of the above, sending it's, us emails about how much you like it, all that sort of thing really helps. Yep. Keep it going. It's uh, It's been fun for us, and uh, I know for many of you out there around the world, having some uh, musical inspiration, maybe picking up some new tunes. So send in those requests. We're going to start in the key of... G. G. Make sure my banjo's in G. Let's get all tuned up. Requests coming in?
As always, we'll play the tunes a couple times nice and slow, and then pick up the tempo. So try to hang in there. Fingers warmed up. Okay. Okay. Yeah, all that fourth finger stuff happening. Did you see any others out there? No, that's that well, was I know that Armstrong's patty on the turnpike. Yeah, we had that. that, we, that was that was earlier today. Yeah, so let's do that. That was requested just now. You know that catfish by Alani, Golden Ticket, Kathy. Yeah, Sarah Armstrong's parent and Turnpike. All right. We'll do them all. Let's do it. Sarah Armstrong's Patty on the Turnpike. All right. Love it. Here we go. Get ready. Thank you. 
off this one year anniversary jam of the Baltimore Old Time Jam virtual, online, on the internet. We've come a long way since yeah. that first jam, an entire eight feet. <laughs> we used to sit over right there, there, right? Eight yeah. feet away. <laughs> and it feels exactly the same. <laughs> no, but we waited. We had a lot of improvements, cameras, yeah, new... lights. Now, when we say we, we mean Brad you. and I have spent <laughs> right. money on new camera. New laptop, <laughs> Ethernet, <laughs> new of Ethernet that. cables, yeah. <laughs> all kinds of stuff to make this possible, and uh, a lot of that thanks to your contributions. And uh, okay, we've got some what requests coming in. Of course, emoji form requests are prioritized, but you can just write them in, and we'll try to oblige those requests. Yeah, now so, that cat has got bad. some sleepy toilet. I don't know. Right. Sleepy <laughs> Joe. What? Sleepy. Or sleepy... Lazy, Lazy John? Lazy, Lazy John. John. Lazy John. Ah, oh, <laughs> there we go. Okay, let's try that one. Why not? Yeah, it looks that? like right now, it looks like the YouTube, there's nothing happened. Wait, on, on YouTube, YouTube feed? Or maybe it's just like, maybe it's just mine. Yeah, it's out there. It's out there? Okay, great. Yeah. Anybody on YouTube, make a comment. I saw, Mike, I saw Michael Brand out there on YouTube. I'm just not picking up. Oh, never mind, it's there. And it's there. Okay. We're good. I see your face up close. Alright, Lazy John. Are you gonna do that? It's here and I see your face up there. So we're just thanks for uh, putting in some. I know we got second time for North Carolina breakdown. Hold it. Um, your phone off the Wi Fi. Yeah, I can take it off. Well, you're on Ethernet, right? I still. So I cool. should be off. Doesn't matter. It's still the same internet. Okay. I just I don't know why it just basically blank for me, but it's working on the phones. Yeah, it's working. All right. Yeah, let us know if it's working on Facebook. I'll just make sure. It might just be my Facebook thing on my computer. Oops. Let me just take this off. Of that. I don't think I have. All right. Thanks, Mary Lynn. Either. Everything looks fine for Mary Lynn. Okay. Okay. Alright, let's do it. Alright, so Lazy John.
what's up next year on the docket? Oh, Our right. one-year anniversary Baltimore Old Time Jam. Well, I have two requests for that North Carolina breakdown. Let's do it then. Okay, here we go. North Carolina breakdown. Stephen Arthur Smith. North Carolina breakdown. I'm just going to put it out there. This is a tune that's ripe to play a major six chord. At some point in the end, I'm going to change the C chord into an E chord, just okay. to, so you don't freak out there on the other side. In the B part, I'll freak out, out but e chord. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'll snarl and okay. make some faces. All right, here we go.
down. We're recording. <laughs> All right. Probably the only time I've ever played a six chord in. In that too? In the major six. In the, no, in the jam. Oh, yeah, it could be. One, only all over there in time this mm. whole year. Might be. Somebody out there might have some info on that. <laughs> so we've got some, Wait, uh, some documentaries I, of the uh, jam. I, it was when John may, was here. We were maybe like, like Oklahoma. Oklahoma. Played some maybe like old Oklahoma, Oklahoma Rooster. We might yeah, have stuck it. Oh, you're right, you're yeah. right. You're yeah. yeah. right. Mm-hmm. I yeah. slip them in, you know, pretty, pretty often. So we've got uh, a couple more tunes here in G. Welcome in to all of you new folks here to the Baltimore Old Town Jam. What are some other Let us know what you're playing and where you're tuning in from. Maybe uh, anything else you'd like to share about what you've been up to today. It's a beautiful spring day here in Charm City. The sun has been out, the birds are chirping, and it's definitely spring here in Balmer. And we have a nice special surprise for you coming up in a couple tunes. We've got our uh, 8 o'clock, uh, or halfway through the jam, we'll throw, throw in some tips for you, some jamming tips. Um, feel free to send these uh, or share these uh, jams all over the place on Facebook. It's pretty easy. Just click the share button and you'll be able to send it out into the world. Okay, we got a request for Lost Girl. Lost Girl. Oh. Yeah. I love that. I could lead it if you have trouble with it. Maybe we should do an easy one, like a really simple G2. Well, I was thinking about Alani this. Suggested, Alani requested. Yeah, that catfish. Yep. Let's do that one. Yeah, and another I, catfish to a tree. And I had another one that I wanted to send out to my fiddle class, Hollow Poplar. You know okay. that one? Yeah, the one no, that was playing. but we can play it. Yeah, yeah. let's do... So uh, now that catfish and then uh, Hollow Poplar. Okay. Yeah, we'll do this. Go for it. Now that catfish. Oh, right.
Nailed that one. Nailed that catfish <laughs> to a tree from great Steve Rosen out of the Midwest. So uh, we're talking about what was uh, the one we're gonna do? What, what other? There was uh, oh, old hollow popper. Hollow hollow poplar. Yeah. Oh. oh. Mm. Where'd you go, Brad? I've got a present. Oh, oh yeah? yeah. For me. I'm done. Oh, oh, come on in. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see what is in the box. Oh, uh, I don't know. What's in the box? What do you guys think it is? Let's see if we have any guesses out there. Okay, yeah. Think, this is I, the big surprise. I the big think... big reveal. Well, let's think, see. Let's see if we can give them some hints. Wait, guys, for all of you out there. I think it's a puppy. Mmm. I think it's a puppy in a box. I think everybody, everyone, look onto your seats. <laughs> <laughs> you get a car. You get a car. You this get a car. We haven't received winter. enough tips to give everyone cars. <laughs> we would do it. Uh, <laughs> if we had enough, maybe. <laughs> but oh, in, in honor of our one year anniversary Kira. jam. What does Kira say? In one, honor of our one year anniversary jam, we have a very special uh, thanks to our friend uh, Patty Berry with Patapsco Valley. Pottery, great designer who's designed a number of our, our shirts, shirts uh, which we're not mugs, wearing right now. that I was drinking from earlier. Yep. Same. Um, we have a new item of merch for the Baltimore Old Time Jam, and they are. Ba -bum, Baltimore Old Time Jam socks! Check it out! We, we're all wearing them. Might as well pull up our, uh, our britches here. And let's see, we've got, we're all sporting the, the Baltimore Old Time Jam socks. And you can too! And they're good too. They're, for for $20, you can buy them from the Baltimore Old Time Fest website. I'll post the link right now in the chat. We gotta do a and, close up. And uh, why don't you do a close up there? Okay. So we got, we Everyone? got one banjo right there. <laughs> the Fox, Brad Kalodner. Yeah, that would be oh. me. <laughs> yep, Foxy Brad. And that's, that would be Ken retriever on the right Golden there. Retriever. Yep. And then we got him on the, the bass. The big bull fiddle they got. Big bear. The grizzly bear. <laughs> I will That's post the link to the, the Baltimore Old Time Fest store and on the front right here, now on Facebook. There's a Baltimore Old Time Fest. And jam. the merch. And I most importantly, that. on the back. Last it says time. last time. So when you stick up your foot, it, it's the last time. <laughs> so you can read that it says last time. Does it say? Yeah, it says it even up right. So yeah. you stick your feet out and you got last time. So yeah, go and go to our website and uh, thank you, Patty Berry, for the thanks. Awesome thanks, design. Patty Berry, for the design. All the proceeds go to the Baltimore Old Time Music Festival Scholarship Fund. Which and, uh, are we ready to announce that? We aren't ready to announce anything, okay. but we can. We do have some news on the Baltimore Old Time Fest that we will tell you about in May. So stay tuned for more information on that. It's not happening in May, but we have news about uh, future Wonderful. festivals and a big update for you. So I will put a link in the chat, both on YouTube and on Facebook, and spread the word. Let's uh, let's uh, we we got 120 pairs of these, so we have to get rid of a lot of them. <laughs> and like I said, they're twenty dollars plus shipping. 117 now. And uh, <laughs> they're very comfy. They're kind of a thin fit. Very yeah, really very comfy. cozy. Very like nice material. And uh, they fit all sizes. So there's just a one size. You have to do that. Fits all, and you can get the socks by going to the link that I will post repeatedly here in the. Uh, in the chat. Um, okay, I think it's time for another new tune. I think it's appropriate, as Alex just said, shoes and stockings. I think that would be fair. Then we'll do hollow pop <laughs> and go to D. Yeah. <laughs> shoes and stockings.
stockings in honor of our new Ooh. shoes and stockings. Or <laughs> 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 just stockings. <laughs> These could be some thin shoes, I suppose. But yeah, our Baltimore Old Time Jam <laughs> socks. They can be yours. I've waited my whole life to have matching socks with you guys. <laughs> right, that's yeah. right. That's Dreams it. do come true. Right. I'll post the link yet again on Facebook. And uh, yeah, I mean, the story behind this basically is that for those of you unfamiliar with the jam, we uh, my, my house generally is a shoeless house. And uh, so we've, I don't know, wore, we've been wearing our socks for these jams. And... Folks seem to comment on our socks all the time, so we figured, what better way to celebrate our one-year anniversary jam than with some socks, some Baltimore Old Time Jam socks. There's a lot of work yeah. went into it. Patty Berry with Patapsco Valley Pottery helping out, and the design, um, and uh, like I said, all the proceeds go towards the Baltimore Old Time Music Festival scholarship fund, which goes towards uh, school programs and all kinds of fun initiatives that the festival has. So we've got uh, maybe what one more in G? One more, yep. Okay, hollow poplar? Yep. Okay, let's go for it. All right. Let's see, I think I'll go. Yeah. Got it. Okay, I have to do the little download there. There we go, hollow poplar.
key of G. Let's go to the key of D, everybody. Woo. And it's time for our uh, jam tips section of the jam. It's almost 8 o'clock, so uh, yeah, might as well just okay. go around with some, some jam tips. Anybody uh, want to kick things off? Yeah, I've got one. Uh, playing what to do when the tune gets going fast. Mm. <laughs> How do you survive that? Um, maybe faster than you used to play playing. Well, I'll give you just a couple little tips. One is to remember to breathe. Uh, I think I would say that's the most important thing for me. Is I, I have been in jams when I go, oh my, this is really fast, faster than I've ever played it. Just breathe. That's number one. And number two is play lighter. Everything, at least on fiddle, and I'm sure it's true with guitar and banjo. Yeah, you play lighter. So the fingers get a little softer here, my bow gets a little shorter and just a little lighter. Just lighten up everything and uh, it allows me to go a little faster and not panic. Yeah, trying so, to play super loud. Right. Just yeah. The more tension you put on your instrument, the slower and more cramped up you get. So that's what I do and I also, sometimes I'll simplify. So I'll just drop out a whole bunch of notes. If I feel like I can't really get all those notes in, I'll just take a bunch out and just kind of hit the highlights of the tune, just play the big notes, the big ske uh, the skeleton of the phrase, um, you know, just to simplify the whole thing. So there's some tips for playing faster. You guys have something? Uh, yeah, Alex, you got anything? Uh, I'd say in, in terms of playing fast, when you're playing an instrument like the banjo or the guitar or the man lesson where you're strumming, as you play faster, you, your strums, you might, when you're playing really slow, you might strum all the strings. And as you speed up, you're definitely gonna make your your strums smaller to keep that rhythm going. But you know, always need to strum all the things that will save your right hand. You know, you'll find that you'll start to play things a little different. So you do like a, like four of yeah, the strings? Yeah, like, if I'm going like, if we're playing really slow, but like, Stay on the bottom there. That's the same on banjo. You know, I tell my students all the time that when you're doing a strum, you don't have to strum all four strings. You can play, you know. Right. When I play so, fast. So right now you're just grabbing the. When I play two. fast, I just play the first or second string. Mm -hmm. Just playing those top couple strings. As opposed to. Instead of going. So it gets kind of cluttered. Yeah, and, and thrashy. A little thrashy, it's a lot yeah. of control. So. Mm -hmm. yep. so something like that, you know, it's yeah. a little bit cleaner sound. Um, and then I guess while we're on the topic of playing with more tempo, uh, one thing that I would encourage you to try is actually spend some time practicing at faster speeds. Don't wait until a jam setting until you're really giving it a shot at a fast tempo. Like, I spend time with the metronome working on playing faster with Bumping recordings. Yeah. You know, starting at like 90 beats per minute, then cranking it up to 100, 110, 120, and I'd say typically, you know, 130 is like a nice goal to have on any instrument um, for the, the fastest jams. You know, some bluegrass, some old time jams will, will get a little faster, but I think one, 120 to 130 is kind of your long-term goal in terms of beats per minute. So that's how I look at it. Um, but I, I make sure that I, I actually spend time like working on playing faster. It's not just something that I hope happens in a jam. Right. Um, you have to actually practice it. So if you don't feel like you're super confident playing fast right now, you do have to actually spend some time practicing it, just like any other skill. Practicing the feeling of being relaxed and comfortable with a, with a faster tempo. And you might consider simplifying the melody too. Like you don't necessarily have to play all the melody notes when you're playing faster. Um, you know, removing some of the non-critical notes can help you can help you get there. But uh, yeah, we've played a bunch of tunes a little quicker tonight than we normally do, and I think that's a, a fitting that's why theme. I thought of it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I, uh, let's yeah. see here. Uh, we're in the key of D now. Yep. Where are those D requests, everybody? You've been so attentive. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, feel free to. Uh, I posted a link in the Facebook group or the Facebook event or the the video for the link for the socks, the new Baltimore Old Time Jam socks. We could play the tune that has been the most played tune. Which of, is what? Of this, uh, so our friend Kira, uh, fi Kirja. Uh, fi Kirja, uh, Fiddler out there, has been to uh, every jam, I believe, every one of these jams, and she's kept a, ta a tally of every tune that has been played just about. 
And uh, she report, wrote, reported to me t that uh, today uh, that the most played tune of the jam is Spotted Pony. All right, well, let's Leaves, do our big hit. All, Spotted yeah, Pony. So this is the hit of the jam. So here we go, Spotted Pony.
at Spotted Pony in the key Woo. of Jimbe. Uh, Janine Smith got to tune in and hear that one. <laughs> what happened? It's one of her favorite tunes. And that's been, Janine, just so oh, you okay. know, that's been the most played tune here at the online of Baltimore. So if there is one to show up. Slow Jam over the last year. <laughs> Whiskey before breakfast. Oh, Colin, That's you good. nailed it with those emojis. Nice one. Yeah, <laughs> it. Let's do that one, I guess. Right, Whiskey yeah. before breakfast. Keep on with the tunes with all the chords. Maybe I'll play this on guitar. Okay. It's kind of a nuisance on guitar, but <laughs> a lot of chord changes. Can you keep that thing in standard? Hmm? What do you mean? Not put the cable on? Yeah. Or, yeah, you can Where? put the cable on. I'll just retune it. What do, do you mean? mean? It's just a little panicky. You know? yeah. I can get my guitar. You can play over you. You can play you can get my guitar. Alright, whiskey before breakfast. Here it goes.
Nice request there from Colin. All right. How about a waltz? You want to try a swine or a waltz? Sure, we can do that. We can get you too many of those. Yeah. I could play a uh, hammer dulcimer, twin fiddles, either way. What are we going to do? I haven't played any hammer dulcimer, so maybe we'll jump on that for a little bit.
Waltz. Swan and Noah Waltz by Raina Geller, performed here by Ken and Brad Kalander, Alex Lacomont. The Baltimore Old Time Jam, one year anniversary jam. Let's do one more in D. Maybe one, more a, one more in D? Yeah. Yeah, well, maybe one or two more, I don't know. Yeah. We'll just do one more. We, we don't get to A that often. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see. What, what D requests have come in? All right. Uh, we, well, we had uh, Diamond, D, we had, uh, plus diamond. Buck Mountain. Plus Wait, silver. Diamond. 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 Jewel, Gem. Who? Julianne Johnson. Here, Julie, Julianne Johnson. Oh, what was, what was it? that one? That's a good what one. What was Lonnie. the Diamond thing? Jewel. 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 Oh, Jewel.
Nice request there, Alani. Nice emoji. <laughs> right. Submission. Got, That's a good one. Uh, yeah, let's see. We got, uh... Everybody yeah, we're halfway through 8 o'clock. Let's go to A. Why not? Yeah. Cool. Key of A, everybody. Woo! I am gonna retune for this. And for those of you who missed it earlier, we have Baltimore Old Time Jam themed socks for you. They are now available on the Baltimore Old Time Fest website in the, uh, the store. BaltimoreOldTimeFest.com. I will put the link in the Facebook chat and again on YouTube so you can purchase the new socks. They're $20. It, yeah. Did you see that? <laughs> they feel great. Yeah, they're very, very comfy, very soft. And uh, very formal. These would work well with a nice suit. <laughs> These are the open or some, socks. Or some overalls that kind of match any occasion. When you and all your vaccinated buddies get together for an outside jam, wear your Baltimore old time socks to the event. Show off your great socks with animals. <laughs> Take off your shoes to let them know and then, and then that the end of the tune is coming up. <laughs> You can only do that with the Baltimore Old Time Jam Socks. At our next jam, we'll have to request everybody to take photos of themselves with their socks on playing <laughs> in the jam. Because uh, there has been a funny theme of people taking pictures of their socks and sending them into the Baltimore Old Time Jam Facebook group. So next time, when you all get your socks... I'd say the people who took pictures of their socks really uh, propelled this sock brush yes. into... To where oh, it is yeah. now. Yeah, so thank you. <laughs> Each and every one of you. It's funny because the Baltimore Old Time Fest, we've been thinking about making socks for that festival for a while. This is a good kick mm. for that. What do we have in A? Any requests? Yeah. that one earlier. And, then, oh, and you said, what is that? Never get tired of Fire on the Mountain. Fire on the Mountain, yeah, we can do that one too. So let's do Old Yeller yeah, Dog Request much earlier. And thanks to all of you who are contributing to the virtual tip jar. Um, How's Old Yeller Dog Dog? There's the Venmo. Do you want me to play it on fiddle? Yeah, yeah, that's not, I'm like, I got that okay, old I'll horse and buggy in my head right now. Okay, so. Old dog. Oh, we get it out. A. <clears throat> oh, we got we got chicken pen. That's right. Chicken honey. Mm -hmm. Here. I'll yeah. give you a pass on this one, Ken. Even though we play I it, played it every single times. concert. I know. It's just like I can't get that old horse and buggy. You're all about the dogs. Too. Yes, I know. <laughs> old yellow dog. Yeah. <laughs>
There you go, old yellow dog, come trot through the meeting house. Woo! Uh, Boo Shot Lincoln, what else was on there? Um, uh, oh, there's Bullet Bull the Wagon. wagon. Uh, and then right over on Don't Chisel. Tipping Back the Corn, Rhett, uh, uh, Little Billy Wilson, Old Horse and Buggy, Lady on the Green. As Kevin Enoch says here, happy one year anniversary of the Old Time Jam Lockdown series. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Kevin. <laughs> well, we aren't totally on lockdown. It is impressively similar. <laughs> and the fact that we are still here jamming. We're, we're thinking about, you know, the future of this jam and, uh, so many of you keep tuning in and contributing and donating, it's kind of hard to stop it, even when things creep back to normal and we have in-person jams. Um, so we're, we're sort of toying with the idea of keeping it going, maybe once a month. I don't know. We haven't quite figured it out. Um, we, in addition we love, to their We love doing these jams yeah. and bringing them to you, yeah. especially all of you all, all around the world um, who can't otherwise make it to our jams in person, because uh, I know many of you have never actually been to the Baltimore Old Time Jam uh, here in Baltimore. So... When we get back to doing the in-person jam, we will uh, we'll sort of figure out whether or not we keep this going, depending on how many folks are out there still willing to tune in. Um, but you know, we'll we'll, uh, we'll tinker with this as we go. But we might we might scale back and do once a month, maybe later on in the summer or something. But we'll keep doing this every other week while there's demand and interest. So if you have any thoughts about it, feel free to email us. Um, you know, leaving comments in the chat here uh, is not super helpful on that front, just because. Uh, you know, so they go, by, go yeah. by quickly, so these are pretty fleeting comments, so feel free to write us if you have any thoughts about how often you might want to tune in, um, what format you know works, uh, any of that kind of stuff. So we will, we will certainly keep it going as long as there are people tuning in and uh, it feels worthwhile. So um, yeah, that's right. just a quick little PSA on that and the future of the jam as things, you know, all get vaccinated, Great. start having in-person jams and stuff just started to do some of those things so anyway um all right so let's do one cool what what's, what you got uh, oh dull chisel that was, that was one booth child lincoln yeah that's kind of similar to the last one what about old, uh, what about little billy wilson that's kind of similar that's it yeah yeah sure i'd like to do at least make sure we get one from the youtube we don't think we've gotten one request from youtube yet so What's that one? That's a Alan Newhouse on YouTube. What did he request? Yeah, he requested Little Billy Wilson. Okay, that's that one. Let's do that. Little hey, Billy Wilson. This is for you. This is uh, three parts, right? You betcha.
weird note. <laughs> okay, we've got time for a couple more tunes here at the Baltimore Old Time Slow Jam. Thanks to all of you who've contributed via uh, Venmo or PayPal. Definitely appreciate that. And uh, let's see, what have we got some these strings. Rain B and here it sounds like blue. What? Maybe we can do another song like uh, uh, Big Eyed Rabbit. Oh, that's a great one. Yeah. Can we do that one, get everyone singing along. Okay. This one we used to do all this one would always all get time. the jams going. Yeah, you gotta have five and done. It might be time to bust out the uh, the one year anniversary celeb celebratory. <laughs> the other day, uh, I played this tune, uh, Big Eyed Rabbit, while I was at Elk Neck State Park and I saw a rabbit in the woods and I happened to have my harmonica on me. And my girlfriend Kathleen took the phone from me and I chased a rabbit playing this song and it ran away. <laughs> so, what a story, right? <laughs> Fascinating. <laughs> tell it again, tell it again. Okay, well. The other day. Many it, years ago. I, the other day in my backyard I saw a rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? There you go. Yeah, just. <laughs> I'm just trying to top him, you know, with that my story. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Silhouette. <laughs> this is what everyone, like, tunes out. <laughs> <laughs> We're celebrating the one-year anniversary of our Baltimore Old Time Jam. In style. With the lights. It doesn't sound like old time. Oh, okay, here it's we disco. Go. Oh, sorry. He's just, you know, he's just showing off. <laughs> I wouldn't go off that showing off. <laughs> we just, we just look like silhouettes now, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. They don't need to see us. This is, uh, this is uh, music. <laughs> we'll turn so, the lights back on. So, oh, Big Eyed Rabbit. Big Eyed Rabbit. Maybe I can turn on a little bit of the light. <laughs> Playing this up the tempo, pretty much, or just uh, like we can do um, techno old time. <laughs> Janine Smith, yeah. Techno old time. That's right. <laughs> it's happening. Okay. Yeah, let's go for it. Um, let's put it down tempo. Here we go.
that we shoot it, fry it in the pan, <laughs> catch it. That's not very nice song. I know. It's not, I know. It's, it's not really a... It's not I a love, love the, song. the song. The, <laughs> I don't know if I'd say I, we, we express love towards the big-eyed rabbit no. through the actions <laughs> of the song. Uh, welcome to our... Uh, well, we've got time for maybe one more tune. Maybe we've got five minutes. Yeah. Cool. Well, let's do What's uh, it gonna one be? more. Can What's it going to be, everybody? Let's... Uh, Heck a Let's quick... throw a couple requests out there, which everyone gets to five likes first. We'll do that one. How about that? First one to five likes that somebody requests right now. We're gonna do it. And uh, while we're doing the uh, the poll, uh, thanks so much to all of you for tuning in yes. for this past year. Very this much. has made our uh, COVID life just a, a little bit more manageable and enjoyable. A lot of these right. tunes yeah. alive. Yeah. Yeah, definitely much more fun having this regular uh, gig. Uh, it's basically a gig at this point. Um, <laughs> we really uh, look forward to this every week, and uh, we'll certainly keep it going as long as y'all keep tuning in and donating and purchasing these new snazzy socks that are available on our. I'll post the link yeah. again. I, I'm, you know, it's been a year. But it's a, a year I'm grateful for. I, I've grown as a guitar player. Yeah. And right. I've learned so many more tunes. And, you know, I mean, I can't wait till we can, like, actually just jam with people. But I'm, I'm very grateful to everybody out there. On the we, are the people. Screen. We're, we are people. Other people. Uh, <laughs> other people. I wasn't <laughs> you guys. Come on, no, Ken. I know what you mean. I know what you mean. <laughs> Even though we haven't heard you guys out there play at all, we literally haven't heard a single note that you've played, but I'm sure there are some beautiful notes. It would be kind of cool if there was a way to, like, uh, record what everybody's playing and Send mash it, it up and see what it sounds like. It probably <laughs> would actually sound a lot like the Baltimore Old Town. Yeah, yeah cause you like get, the in-person jam is just a cacophony of just swarming mm. bees humming in it's a for, key for an hour. For those who have never been, it, we've had as many as 65, 70 players there yep. at the jam. So it's it can be quite a scene. Yeah, like 40 fiddles. Right. Tons of banjos. and Looks like Waterbound is taking the lead. Otherwise, we've wow. got a ship... Dancing? What? Boat? Boatman. 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 So Boatman or Waterbound? Those seem to be the leading contenders. Which one? Everyone gets five votes first. Well, we got, we got on YouTube, we've got three for uh, Buffalo. Well, actually, it's Peter. Peter said it three times. <laughs> <laughs> for Buffalo Gals? Yeah, but Hunting the Buffalo. Oh, Hunting uh, the Buffalo. Yeah. 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 Uh, Waterbound's got four. Okay, you know that one, right? Uh, sort of, yeah. I mean... Uh, banjo thing is it? Waterbound it's got five boots. Yeah, yeah. That yeah. yeah. We do it nice and slow. Waterbound, here we go. Sounds like the winner. Okay, here we go.
<laughs> What's going on in this corner? I think that's it. <laughs> we did it! Melted for all it's worth. We did it! <laughs> One year of jamming. Beep, beep. Wow, Woo. welcome to the second year of ah. Baltimore Old Time Jam. Oh. 365 more days. <laughs> no. <laughs> nah. nah, not at all. Uh, well, uh, thanks for being part of this yet again. Pick up those socks. They're available on our Baltimore Old Time Fest uh, merch uh, site. I posted the link at the top of the Facebook video. And... Uh, yeah, we've got a lot of them, so please buy as many as you like. <laughs> yeah. We can always use more socks, right? I feel like I'm yeah. always losing my socks. Well, right. Should we... <gasps> wait, I just have a theme for... Is it possible to make an entire jam out of... Uh, Sock tunes? Uh, well, shoes? Cl clothing articles. Clothing? Uh, mm. Articles of clothing. Yeah, articles of clothing. Yeah. Yeah. Greasy coat. Yeah. Greasy coat. <laughs> Think of it. I don't know if you want to do a theme again, you know? Yeah, yeah, we'll do some theme yeah. jams. All right, so long, everybody. Thanks for participating. <laughs> See ya. Mm -hmm.